beat their Western Conference rival going into this game. At the Staples Center, where the Clippers will try to turn it up on their home floor. 2K Sports is proud to present NBA basketball. Alongside Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. So the Clippers win the tip. All fueled up and ready to go. Brought to you by Gatorade. Let's check out who's on the floor. So for New Orleans right now, Gordon is the two with Evans playing small forward. Davis and Ashik patrol the paint. And it's Holiday in at the point guard. You always like to get that first lead of the game. Yeah, you know, Steve, a good way to set the tone early on there. Omer Ashik in the poison pill year of his contract now, making about $15 million this season. That money scared off the Chicago Bulls, but Houston was able to find the taker in the New Orleans Pelicans. And it's blocked by Ashik. Outside Gordon. Evans outside. He dishes it to Holiday. Six on the shot clock. Plenty of space. They grab their own miss. Kicks it out to Gordon. Beyond the arc. Griffin grabs the board. He certainly didn't take advantage of the poor defense, but they can't count on him to continue missing. No, that's for sure, because this guy's too good of a shooter to miss that look consistently. Now here's Barnes. Ball outside. He feeds it to Barnes. Redick for three. No luck. And New Orleans will go the other way with it. And Ashik certainly a great defensive NBA center, Clark. But 15 million, that's, that's a big chunk of change. That is especially as cap conscious as teams are now under the new CBA. He's in a contract year playing for his next contract now. If he does well. It's hard to believe, but his next contract might not be too far off from what he's making right now. Davis with a screen on Paul. And Holiday kicks to Davis. It's hauled in by the Clippers. Reddick for three. That misses. Would have kind of had it gone in. It's all tied here in Los Angeles. Well, up to this point, a closely contested game as we start the second quarter. And taking a look at Los Angeles' performance here, Clark and Steve, what, uh, what have they been doing or not doing? I think it's a good start for this club. They seem to be playing well, and uh, we'll see if they can carry it forward. Well, they hit the ground running and had a really nice beginning to this game, Steve. And it's the Pelicans with the ball. Jared Dudley out there with Davis. Then there's Farmar, then there's Spencer Hawes, and it's Crawford at the shooting guard position. That's who's out there for the Clippers. <laughs> now here's Evans. It's stolen by Davis. And there's the feed to Farmar. The dish to Crawford. Davis with the block. On the wing, Evans. Good on the shot. Evans has got the first points up on the board here in the second quarter for New Orleans. The Clippers trail. Although the Pelicans played some tough games against the West last season, they still showed their youth when it came to competing against the better teams. Let's go to our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Doris, what do you have? Guys, Jamal Crawford fitting right in with the Los Angeles Clippers. He said, quote, this is the best team I've ever been on, and it's made me a better player. I've never played with someone like Chris Paul. He makes the game easy for me. I went my first 10 years in the league without making the playoffs, so that's all I want to do now. Kevin, over to you. In his instant offensive role, he's a big part of their success. Thanks, Doris. As you said, although the Pelicans gave some teams trouble last year in the West, but overall, Steve, the conference was just too much for them. Yeah, 15 wins against the rest of the West, and they do have a lot of work to do before they're viewed as a threat in the conference, but they're getting there. At the line of the moment. Now a starter for his whole career. Tyree Kevin spent most of last season Clark as a sixth man with the Pelicans. Yeah, and you know, Kevin, they envisioned him in a bit of a Manu Ginobili role, providing scoring and playmaking off the bench. But after they were hit with some injuries, he excelled in the starting role. A platoon swap here for the Clippers. 
And it's out of bounds to the Pelicans. I tell you what, that's just a major unforced error right there, guys. My goodness. And a two-for-one opportunity. Yeah, they've got to hurry. Step on the gas here. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Outside Gordon. Davis setting the pick for Gordon. And that's collected by DeAndre Jordan. Jordan's got three rebounds so far in the game. Paul goes in, and it's Jordan with the jam. He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he picks the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. And those could be an important two points, too, guys, in a close game like this one. Holiday gets the bucket. Guys, that time you went for the fancy finish for us there, man. That was sweet. And the first half ends in a close one. New Orleans on top. Yes, guys, I'm here with Anthony Davis. And, Anthony, based on how the game has been going so far, what's your attitude going to be when you come out to play the second half? Oh, you know, we got to come out with a great intensity. And it starts in warm-up, so we got to come out uh, with a great intensity, great mindset. That's our goal there and win the third quarter. Anthony, thank you, guys. It's